Hi, my name is Don Briggs and I'm a member of the team at Breadboard Electronics. This is Project 24 Slow Blink based on our starter kit. Um, very simple circuit, uh, you could use it for a dummy uh, surveillance camera, that sort of thing. Uh, maybe this one should have been 23 and the other one should have been 24 because uh, this one's more simple than the previous project. Um, but again, it's still quite a useful project. Uh, I'm sure people will get some use out of it. Uh, it's always fun building these, making them work, seeing what they do, seeing how they resemble other circuits, and uh, all those, you know, like the, uh, uh, the potential divider bit here, you will remember that over and over again. Um, so let's, let's just see this one working. As you can see, the, the LED is just flashing. Nothing more than that, it's just flashing, but we yeah, we have a, a trimmer in here. Now if we change that, we can change the rate of flash. Just get slower and slower. Like I say, if you had that on a, um, uh, a dummy camera, it would look pretty realistic. It would just flash, just to show that it's on. Now our um, PCB, or our breadboard layout, uh, again, quite a simple, straightforward little circuit, and uh, there's no hidden mysteries in there. It, sometimes the wiring might look a bit messy, especially when you have five five fives, because uh, you are joining a couple of pins, uh, normally four and eight and two and six on a regular basis. So there's just two wires extra, but again, you will get used to uh, putting those wires there. Now, as you can see, we have a, a sort of slow bink. We have our trimmer in here, and we can change the rate of that blink. It's now quite a fast blink. There you go. Lovely little project. It's the end of Project 24. Thank you for watching. Hi, this is Project 24 Slow Blink. There's not much that we can say about this uh, little project that hasn't already been said before. There is a, a 555 timer in the middle. These are the two cables we talked about, or two wires we talked about, which joined 4 and 6. No, it doesn't. It joins 2 and 6 and 4 and 8. Uh, like I said before, you will get used to that, as same as you will get always get used to pin 1 being connected to ground. And that sort of thing. Now we have a little trimmer in here and if we adjust that slightly, oops, we move the whole thing around the table and we will increase our flash rate. Uh, not a complex circuit, lovely little one for a dummy camera, that sort of thing. Uh, and I'm sure there are a multitude other uses for it as well. That's it for Project 24, thank you for watching.